Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at fixing a corrupted Raspberry Pi SD card. To fix the SD card, we need to download the Gparted Live Disk and boot to it on a separate PC with the SD card inserted. Step through the initial Gparted setup by selecting a key map and language. Once you reach the desktop environment, close out of the Gparted UI and launch a terminal. In the terminal, run the command sudo test disk. Press enter to create a new log file. Select the SD card from the listing of disks. Select Intel as the partition table type. Then select Analyze and Quick Search. Press enter to continue twice. Arrow over to select Write and press enter. Then type Y to confirm. Press enter to select OK. Then select Quit twice to exit out of the test disk utility. Back in the terminal, run sudo fdisk-l to list the attached devices and their partitions. Next, we'll use sudo fsck to do a file system check on each of the partitions on the SD card. You'll see in the output here for dev sda2 that my Linux partition had some issues that needed to be corrected. Once you've completed file system checks on each partition on the SD card, close the terminal and shut down the gparted live disk. Plug the SD card back into the Raspberry Pi and power it on to see if the SD card was able to be successfully repaired. In my case, the corruption to the SD card was able to be repaired and I'm able to boot back into my Raspberry Pi OS. Depending on how extensive the corruption is on your SD card, your mileage may vary, so make sure you take backups of your SD cards regularly.